Why does Britain want to exit the European Union? Because of out of control sky high Muslim migration. <coughs> Vote Trump for El Presidente del Universo. But seriously, the answer to the question posed by the title of this video isn't a simple one, dear viewer, but it is important. Even Tomo News analyst Marijuana Man elected to blow his brains out rather than explain this. In the cloak and dagger realm of British statecraft, Europe has long been the elephant in the room. But if you think it's just because of migrants and the free state cash and health insurance they're supposedly showered with upon entry, then you'll find you're actually quite right. But we'd be doing you a disservice if we left it at that. Many British believe their government treats EU migrants better than themselves. Blame for this is largely placed on European laws, which override British laws. As it currently stands, EU migrants entering the UK can work freely and claim state welfare, such as unemployment, healthcare, and child benefits. Britons can also do the same in any other EU country. British Prime Minister David Cameron renegotiated these issues so that EU migrants can only claim benefits after living in the UK for four years. Cameron also ensured that Britain would permanently be able to keep using the pound and protect the UK from the sometimes volatile Eurozone. The uncertainty caused by the UK's European future has shook the markets, with many uncertain how the continent will look if Britain votes to leave. The contention has led to the UK's in-or-out EU referendum on June 23rd, 2016, also known as the Brexit vote. So in review, a simple answer to why does the UK want to break up with the EU may simply be that Europe enjoys taking a crap on British law, and Britons don't like being crapped on. Except for those pesky Scottish nationalists. They'll happily take Europe's crap over Westminster's crap any day of the week. Which is probably why they say, if the UK votes to leave the EU and Scotland wants to stay, there'll be another vote on Scottish independence. So to the Scots, we say this. FREEDOM! Coming to you in 2017. Uh, probably.